Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky and I'm here in our Spidertron. And last time we started to build the station for what will become the Blue Circuit Arena here. So uh, we do want to get our building train. Let's go and check on it. Is it okay? It is not okay. We have left this tiny bit too long. So what we're going to do is change this to five seconds. Uh, yes. And then click that off and then go back to the base. Um, I would really like it to come to me though, where I am, but we don't have this connected to our network yet. So let's go ahead and connect this here. Let's see, this is rails out. So that's going to be coming here. And it doesn't fit quite that well here. So we might actually have to change this here. Oh dear. Oh dear. Spidertron help. Okay. Well, we need some other help instead. Let's put all of our junk stuff in here. There we go. And sure. Yeah, that guy, that stuff can go back to the main base. We'll pick up these very precious little rails here. And I guess we're going to have to go back into figuring out how this is going to work. Okay. So this is rails out. And I think we can just place it. You know what we can do? Let's do this instead. This is going to be easier. And get this one to go like that. And then get this guy and place it with the right angle curve here. Yes. Okay. And rails out in alignment. There we go. Okay, and we'll take this bit off because we don't need that. And we can remove that one as well. Okay, and we can see a lot of the biter detritus over here. All of these stones and things that are... It's like if we move over them, of course, we can pick them up. Okay, that goes this way. All right, and uh, we do need to signal this properly because obviously it is not done because we had to modify it to our needs. Go ahead and take that this way and then have a second signal going out there and one waiting there. That's great. And chain signal going that way. Very nice. Okay, good, good, good. Now then, um, I think we're going to have to do the same thing right over here. Let's go ahead and get this one to come. Come on, rotate. There we go. Thank you much. There we are. There we are. And we will do the rails in after we get our 90 degree curve because we're going to do the same thing on this side so rails in oh i need to change that so that's one thing that i like to do is have oh no they are on the same alignment the rails out and in hmm. interesting okay let's take this off and take uh uh hmm Right, this doesn't quite work this way. <laughs> no, the sadness is here. No. Wait a second. We have to go from this side, right? Why is this one going this way? Am I using the wrong one? Rails out. Yes, I'm using the wrong one. Yeah, it needs to be this one. Okay, so let's control Z this whole affair. Hello? Please? No? Oh, no. Oh no, it kind of forgot. Oh dear. All right, well, it's fine. It doesn't really matter. I think I, I didn't think I was 10 steps beyond, but I guess I was, I don't know. All right, anyway, it doesn't matter. We can easily finagle this to the best of our ability. So let's put on our signals, of course. This one going there. And, oh, that sound. Now the medium sound is starting to bother me. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, it looks like we have a second signal here. Shoot. Let's take off one of them. Okay, let's take this here. Sure. No idea what that is. Let's make sure that this one is too close to existing rail signal. I don't know what's going on here. Why is there one here that I can't change and can't see? All right, whatever. Let's, that's going to be the thing. 
Um, okay, so if this comes in this way, I'm going to go ahead and put another chain signal right there because we don't want it to rest here unless it can go into this block here. So I think that'll work. Now we will have one to close this block there and we're good to go. Okay, so we do need some power here. Uh, wow, we need a lot of things over here. These are ghosts, I think. Wow. We are out of all the stuff and all the things. Oh, I need to turn on my personal RoboPort. They can fix stuff. Hooray. All right, so this is going to be building at Blue Circuits. Uh, let's see, Blue Circuits. Okay, yay, good, good. Very good. Um, let's figure out what we need. I don't know if we need train rails. Um, probably not, but we'll leave it. Okay, let's just go through this thing and figure out what we do need. Undergroundies, thingies, and stuffies. Um, modules, sure. Wow, that's a lot of modules to have uh, excess of here. I think we just want an extra of 10. I need to go back and check the other um, outposts and see what those readings are on those. Because that's kind of important. Okay, let's look at these. Furnaces we do not need. I don't think we need. No. And mining we also don't need. Unless we connect it. No, 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 no. We will, we'll, we'll put it to zero. And we'll also put furnaces to zero. <laughs> Just in case we happen to share this building train station with another one. Um, because that might come into play at some point so yeah my goodness we have a lot of um chests and stuff five i wonder if this is i i think this is a blueprint that i had from a while back um and i had to reload my old file from way 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 long ago because i had that error with stuff and i think it doesn't have the the newer values that i like for these items here all right um, we do not, however, need refining stuff. How far is this place? Let's see. It's quite far from here, I think. It's close to here, though. But I think we don't need any chemical plants uh, or refineries or palm jacks. Probably not. No. Storage tanks. Eh, no. Probably, well, let's say two. I don't know. And none of the nuclear stuff, for sure. And pumps, I don't think we need any. Maybe two. Now, why is this one here? Hmm, confusion. All right, well, it's not going to be there for long. Okay, I think we're good. I think we can tell the building train to come around. Um, and set, let's set up a new train station for blue circuits. Blue, blue, hello. Add for five seconds of inactivity. We'll put those at the very top. And something is clearly wrong here. There is some item that is not connected the correct way. These are connected, I believe. Yes? No? I can't tell if they're connected. This is not connected. Oh no, did I still forget to do this? Oh jeez Louise. Okay, nobody tell on me. I promise I won't do it again. Yeah, there's this issue of slightly... Yeah, it's fine. It'll be fine. Nobody's heard anything. Nobody saw anything. Definitely not a thing. Okay, it's coming to Blue Circuits in any case. So we'll just keep that right to ourselves and nobody will have to say anything about it. I will say that I would like to have the building train uh, wait for a tiny bit. So empty cargo and and then I might need extra uh, of the uh, railroad tracks and stuff. But we'll go ahead and build all this stuff out while we're waiting. Because why not? It's great. Now this obviously needs to be relocated further south, like there, sure. Uh, and then we will connect this bit. No, no, not that way, not that way, this way, thank you. And this is gonna be rails in, very nice. 
Okay. Oh, that's a spider tron over there. Oh, I see our building train. Excellent. All right, bots, you will have to do your laps tomorrow because you are clearly not fit. You need to run faster, fly faster, whatever faster, just as long as you do it faster. Um, all right, so we do need to cover this area with a RoboPort network. I'm going to take all of the train tracks. How many of these do I have? I don't need that many, so that's fine. Mm, power poles, yeah, let's take one stack. And then I'm going to transfer all these railroad tracks into the Spidertron, since we almost never build anything directly from um, our own inventory without also dealing with the Spidertron. So that's a nice thing to have. Let's see, I'll also put in a couple of sets of thingies here for the Spidertron, because I think that's kind of useful. Uh, because I want to just fill, fill her up, as they say. Oh, wow. Done with uh, train stations, too. Let's go ahead and just stack them all in here. And meanwhile, I will unstack these things that don't belong in here. Okay, very nice. And yeah, I think we're good on that. I was like, hey, did I shift click or control click away some of the things I needed? I don't think so. So should be fine. Oops, there we go. And I think this should be okay. Uh, we're not going to need any of these raw materials here anyway. And I will go ahead and grab anything else that I need. Okay, I have plenty of undergroundies. Need a bit more. Eh, not that many belts, actually. Really don't need that much. Gonna need some roboports. Uh... Probably not that many. I do want to put some back into the Spidertron as well. Uh, all right. Are we good? I think we might be good. I'm going to try to put lights. I'm going to put lights right now um, because <laughs> I always forget. So uh, do we have room for <laughs> No, we don't even have room for lights. Who are you kidding, KOS? Come on. <laughs> you don't even have room for lights. Lights are never on your plan. I can tell. Wait, who's talking now? Never mind. Um, <laughs> it's fine. I'll just put them at the beginning and the end there. Dear me. Okay, I do need... Let's see. I think I need engines and... I need train stops. That's right. I gave all of those to the Spidertron. And otherwise, I think we're pretty good here. So, okay. We, we have... Um, let's rename this. This is going to be Blue Circuits. Uh, sulfuric Acid. Let's see. S. Uh, we'll just call it Sulf acid drop off okay good and this is a bit of a blue color and i've kind of forgotten how not blue yellow yellow my friends it's all yellow yellow that is definitely not yellow oh but that's closer hello ah there we go red and green makes yellow remember that um all right so we have this stuff here this is good um two pipes is definitely more than enough for the arrays that we're going to have here now the next train station that we want to add and i think we can route these easily off to the side here we're going to want reds next and i think we can have uh probably a an eight train even though we're not going to need that many but it is going to help us kind of um yeah Utilize our circuit things better. Uh, we can use like one of these very simple unloaders, which is just more than we need actually. But do we have it the other side? Let's see if we can find one of these unloaders on the opposite side. Is that the right side? It is. It is the right side. Isn't that nice? All right. So let's copy this. By the way. Did you know that the land of lions is out? <laughs> yes, I hope you will be following my adventures in the land of lions very shortly. And uh, you'll find that uh, in another video. Not this one, of course, obviously. But yeah. Okay. Uh, we're going to have this one here, I think. Let's see. That is fine. I think that's fine. 
Now, I do need to make sure that this is beyond the curve. So, I think it's here. Excuse me. Think. Behave. Please. There we go. Like this. This is fine, I believe. Okay. But we are going to need some chests. Oopsies. Where did I put those chests? Not here. Um... Where did I put them? Oh no, I lost them. There they are. Some. Yay. Okay, um, and obviously we do have some undergroundy bits coming from there, which we don't need. So we're going to take off some of this stuff uh, here. There we go. I can do something fancy for those little undergroundies. You can just right click this and do a... Uh, whitelist or removal of these guys here and just drag it across. Hooray. Excellent. Now this is going to be taking off red circuits. So let's just take that as not a red circuit. Not usually. Not today. We're going to say not today. Might be in another timeline. Another place. Another time. In the twilight zone. Well, maybe. Okay. Let's get the curve we want. There we go. Boom. And then we do, do need our signal here. Excellent. I do feel like we have forgotten to add signals to our own inventory. So let's go and add those. Maybe put one back. Okay. So this is what we've got. This is not bad. Let's do one more thing. Let's take this thing off. Okay, so this is, we're going to copy paste this for the name, but this is going to be red circuit drop off. Okay, and this is going to be red. Hooray. Okay, so that's one thing done. Now, the sulfuric acid can come around this way probably. And then these guys, I think we're just going to have to go through... How should we do this? What I'm thinking is that the green circuits can come off and actually these could just go right through this whole thing. Like if we did this again and these guys, oh wow, I shouldn't have deleted those thing imaging, should I? Nope. Bad KOS. The bad is bad. Okay, those don't quite align, do they? Not quite. Um, yeah. yeah. I think this is going to be okay. I don't actually think that we do need a balancer here. I think that things are going to... Well, we, we're going to need a balancer either on the green or on the red. And maybe the red is a better one to balance. But then we'd have to have another... Another thingy thing. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. It doesn't really matter that much. Because what we can do is just sort of like pre-balance these things. By doing something like this. Like this. And then take out one of each of these things. So let's see if we copy this bit and do something like this. Yes, that, that seems reasonable. Let's see here. And then here. Okay. One thing I don't like about building in the Spider-Tron is this very sort of like queasy effect you get. It's like rocking back and forth thing. It's like, huh? Yeah, not ideal, but it's okay. It isn't, like, awful, awful, but it's a bit annoying. Okay, let me grab one of the four to four balancers. This is just kind of like a real quick way to balance things quite easily. And I think it will work fairly decently. Not, like, not too bad. It's probably not going to be full throughput, but that's not what we care about necessarily. Uh, oh, wow. These are, here's a, here's a blue one. Okay, yay. Copy. And then this one can go probably not there. So let's just put it over there for now. 
because all of these I think are going to make a curve uh, where we're going to need to get the rest of this other thing going. Oh, that's handy. <laughs> Look at that. All right, let's turn this thing off, filters off. Uh, all right, and we'll build the next train station. So this is going to sort of ish balance or at least take from each car if cars are getting empty or whatever and not have to rely on the green circuit train leaving or something even if something just kind of goes a tiny bit slow it'll be fine but I really don't want to take eight lanes down here I mean you can but eh, it's not really that necessary so um but I think with the greens, it might be a good idea to balance those because the greens are going to be our biggest throughput item with stuff. So I want to copy. I think I'll just copy this entire thing. Can I copy that? Yay. Okay, good, good. And this thing can go kind of like that. Yeah, good, good. Yes, I think so. I wonder if that's ish okay to put here. Let's try this. Let's see if we can do this here with this. No, no, rotate. Other rotation, please. This way. I really want you to go there. No. You see, if we do this, we'll have to have a really big curve. Uh, okay, let's try it the other way first and try like this, say. We can have it there or there. Okay, let's have it there and then just remove this whole thing and move it. Ah, that's much better. Okay, excellent. So now we'll control V again and then zip this down right here. I think here is the here. Yeah, that's the, that's the correct here that we want. Remove this. Okay. Life is now okay. We'll go here and tell this one to take off green circuits instead. And then here we want the green. Yes. There we go. Yay. All right. Very nice. Beautiful. Oh, this is so good. You know what? I say this is really good, and it is good, but I'm also smelling garlic bread that's been cooking in my home. <laughs> so I'm like, oh, is this a smell of Factorio, or is this, like, is this Blue Circuits, or is this something else? We don't even know. But we're just going to be fanciful today, and it's going to be fine. So we want this uh, corner. It's always nice to just grab a corner from somewhere else if you can. There we go. Right there is perfect. And then we'll grab some of these belts. Okay, and then have these undergroundies go over there. So copy the whole undergroundy thingy without those thingies. Okay, now then, I think, yeah, having an 8 to 8 balancer is going to be good. So let's move this guy. Place this over here in our sort of pseudo red balancer, which is just going to be just fine. And then we're going to get our 8 to 8. So let's go into our blueprint book, which is doo -doo -doo -doo, belt balancers, balancers blue, 8 to 8. Here we go. Nice. And we'll just center it on this whole thing with, let's see, that's the center. One, two, three three yes good because we do have this extra bit there okay there we go apologies for that sound if you hear anything okay Oopsies, come on. There we go. Excellent. So what I did with the counting there is basically I just decided that I needed X amount of space to turn these belts and move them down. I did have one extra space from when, from the blueprint itself. 
and then I just counted and I put it in the center so I had four and they all go into like this perfect fountain here and it's quite lovely. Now then, uh, let's look at our blueprint because here we're going to need a full blue belt for each of these lanes. So we only need four of these arrays. So let's just, um, I guess we'll, let's just copy this for now and then we're going to reverse it and figure out what we're going to do with this. So let's put this in here. Oopsies. Go away. Okay. Oh. And three and four. Hooray. Okay. And here, I guess we can do some of this belt magic. You know what I forgot to do? I did forget to put the entrance... Oh no, something is very wrong here. No! The last two. <sighs> okay, it's fine. The last two are actually reversed. That one, That's not ideal. Um, all right, so what I can do also is do the copying a little bit better here. Let me get out of this Spider-Tron because the wobbliness is a little bit interesting. So um, here's what we want to do for this. Go in and in. And I guess that's good. Okay. Okay. And then we want to have this here. And then we want to have our belt braiding start right there. Okay. So this is going to be the red where the red comes in. Let's put it on this side. And then we're going to have our greens come in. So let's copy this entire section here. And then paste it here. And then we'll paste the whole lot. Mm. One on this side. Correct uh, direction on those belts. Hooray. There we go. Let's park this over there instead. Alrighty. So now we can equally divide these guys. So this is one, two, three, and four. So this is the center one. Let's go out first. Okay, and then because we do want to have a section where the reds come through. So let's see, one, two, three, and four. This one is coming here. Okay, nice. Alrighty, and... Ah, very nice. Okay, cool. They look like the legs of a great spider. Tron. Whoa, bad joke. Um, no, I'm just joking. It is kind of cool, though. They, uh, if you, if you measure things out nicely, you can get these kind of, like, nice spidery effects here. Um, all right. Now then, we have one, two, three, four. Imagine that. Four entrance ways to these areas so let's go ahead and take these belts along i'm gonna go ahead and do the um yeah one two three four five and go there that's four good good and i guess we can just do a cross like this for all of them see now this is something i forgot about <laughs> No worries. And I'm going to just do this one for good measure in case we need to get eight from there for some unexplained reason. Let's copy the corner again. No sense in reinventing things if we don't have to. Good. And then we're going to copy all of this stuff over. And then that one goes there. This one's going to go here. Let's get these guys going along here. Take this one down and take this one over. Hooray. Oh, this is great. Look at that. That's nice. Oh, the animations are so good. All those belts waiting to take stuff into the world. Oh, so lovely. Okay, so now we do need to get some 
uh, some fortification here with the roboports and also connect these things to our power uh, connections. So let's take that and I think what we'll do is we'll send the building train back to the base. I don't think I'm going to need anything else here. I'll, I say that, you know, and then it's like, oh, geez, I forgot X, Y, Z, right? So, yeah, I hope we're not going to have that happen, but you never can tell. So, anyway, let's see. We can connect this one here. There we go. And then let's put a nice little power pole in there. And then we'll connect this with a big pole out here. That's nice. Okay. And let us also design an exit for this thing. Um... Hmm. I think that this is not going to be available since these guys stick out so much. So what I think would be best is, oh dear, we might need to murder this cliff over here. How is, <laughs> I got a comment, <laughs> Catherine, the patron saint of cliffs. I was highly amused. <laughs> I was highly amused. Um, all right. So let's see. What, what do we want to do with this thing? I think... Yeah, I intended it to go out there, but I think that's not going to be really... Well, could it be? It might be. Oh, we could do some fun stuff, though. Yes, we could do things that are, are unspeakable with these things. Um, Yeah, it's going to be really iffy to get this out here. Maybe. I don't know. Let's see. Can I connect this in any way to that? No. Not easily. So if I do this thing, it's going to have to be way squirrely. We could do squirrely. I'm not afraid of squirrely, but I think, I think it might be a little bit too much for this build. Just a tiny bit. Just a teeny tiny bit. All right. So what we can do here is we want to go the shortest distance, and that's going to be from the top here. Um, let's see. This thing, this thing wants to go that way. This thing is going to have to go around, I guess. I mean, what else other choice is there, right? Yep. Cliffs. This is the reality of cliffs, my friends. Oh, but if we do this, it's going to be really not good for life with us here. Let's go and take this this way. And then... Just make sure that we have the measuring correct. Let's do like this. Yep. Because the thing is, is if you put a line here, it cannot connect to this ever. Like never, ever, ever. It just won't do. So we'll have to just make that happen that way and it'll be fine. So let's go and get our spider tron again. Looks like the bots are already ready to make themselves useful. This is excellent. Part of the pioneering spirit. Really good. I'm very proud of them. Okay, take that this way. And we can then put a signal in front of each track. There we go. And then trains can move up here. And then they can connect to the regular bits there. Oh my gosh, that building train is so fast. Sneak right by me. My goodness. Uh, all right. So now I think that we're going to have to have an interesting kind of a turnaround here. So let's just do this. Let's do that for now. This can be here. Now what we need to get is this to go and shimmy up this way. Oh, oh, that's lovely. Is that not pretty? I like this. But we can also change this and have this. Can I do that, actually? The whole, like, this thing? Yes, I can. All right, let's do that instead. It's kind of more of like a, a side road at the edge of the highway, you know, frontage road, that kind of thing. Yeah. Okay, let us get some signals to fix this. So this one goes here, before the crossing, middle of the crossing, um, and then here again before the crossing, and then we're going to have the uh, regular signals to get out of those blocks. Very nice. All right, and how do we want to deal with this? I think this is fine just as it is. We do need to have one signal there, 
And then this goes this way. I think that's actually fine. Um, yeah, I don't think I want to have more signals there. That's for sure. But we do want to end this block there. And I think that's enough for... Yeah, it's long enough for a max length train. That's for sure. So, um... Do we want one here? I guess we could have another one along here just to speed these guys getting through there. And it's going to be it's going to be fine, I think. Otherwise, we'll put one here as well. I don't think we're going to have more than one sulfur train or sulfuric acid train. So, that's kind of a moot point, but let's put a uh, a radar out here because those are really useful. I also want to connect the power Let's see. Hello. There we go. There's an easy way that the pole like turns sideways when it's connected. I shouldn't like, oh, is it going to fit there? No, no need. Oh, this desert landscape looks so cool. It's really nice. Are we having issues with the Spidertron? No. Okay. Spidertrons, stop being so picky. Okay. Good, good. Okay, so we have a tiny bit of issue with power, I see. So let's get that sorted. We want to have this one right there. That's fine. Good, good. Solved. And then we have a naughty. Okay, we're going to have to fix this whole end thing because this is what needs to be... We need to make an end point for this as well. Um, yeah, let's see how we want to do this whole thing. I think we can do a sneaky thing if we want to. And that is use an undergroundy here. Let's do this because we always use splitters. And I think it's not necessary. Um, can we do... We want the outside of this, right? Yep. And then this one will be... Let's see. Here. Maybe one down below. Let's do one below. And then figure out how long that needs to be. Now, if you're not aware, when you have an undergroundy like this, if you put a belt up against it, there's like a little window and that allows the stuff on that side of the belt to pass. So in this case, on the outside of the belt, we'll allow it to pass over here. Now this one, I think we can just do a splitter here because it's pretty neat. Nice and neat. So let's add that splitter there. And we're going to add, let's see. This is going to be on the outside and this inside. So if we do this, this is going to be perfect. So let's do on the right side, we're going to have blue chips. Good. And so the rest of whatever's coming in over here, the red chips is not going to be there. So now we can get our power pull there and then just copy this entire section here wholesale. Okay. Yep, there we go. All right. Excellent. Powered and all. So now all we need to do is make a train station. So how do we want to do this? We could add... Um, I think we could add a, just a simple train station right here if we wanted to. And I'm wondering if we should make the blue circuit train be a four car train because eight is going to take a billion years to fill up approximately. And we only have four belts anyway. So that might be apropos here. So let's copy this thingy here. Our little belt balancer. It's very handy. Uh, and we'll try to put it in the center. Very nice. I'm going to get out of this. I do a bit lament the very thick forest here. The Spidertron does help, but it only helps if you can walk in it. And it's making me queasy at the moment. Okay. I hope they kind of fix that. That would be kind of nice. The wobbly thing. Not a fan of this. Okay, there we go. I never really noticed it before, but now it's like, ugh, motion sickness. Hello. 
Okay, so we have a 44 here and I still forgot to install that mod for ice for x-ray trees and I would absolutely love to have it right now because this part of life is being a tiny bit annoying. Okay, we did get a new radar there. Let us see. We want to do a a train station like this except on this side. So I think what I'm going to do is take this section and then just add it. Yes, that seems good. All right, very good. So belt balancer there, belts continuing over here, forest knocked down, it's fine. Yeah, there we go. And I sense we have run out of belts. Oh dear. Okay. So, let's see. Let's see. Second one is going to come there. Third one, we're going to need some help from the brush wardens, trees and rocks. Let's just get rid of this stuff. We really don't need these here and I can't see what I'm doing. So that's going to have to be that. Um, oh, gee, I wish I had put this just one further. Just one. It's okay, though. We're okay with spaghetti. I mean, if this train station didn't have a tiny bit of spaghetti, what kind of Factorians would we be? I mean, really? There we go. So that's looking pretty decent. Is this still in range? It is in range. How nice. Okay, so for it's going to be... Now, let's make sure that we don't have to make any major changes here. Let's add a signal there. And we do need to add tracks up, upward. Let's see if we can add the station properly here or if it needs some other... Oh, there it goes. I knew it would fit because it did fit on the other train bit. But just to make sure... Oh my god. Really? Come on. Come on, thing. What you doing? Okay, so this is going to be blue circuits. Blue. Blues pickup. Hooray. This is perfect. Okay, life is now better. Yay. So, um, we can have... We could do a swirly parking. I was highly amused that several people were like, you should call it a queue. And I'm like, but that's so boring. <laughs> it's just like, huh? Why? Why? Why boring name? No? No want? <laughs> anyway, we are going to, I think like a swirly do parking, but we do have kind of like splittery do. So maybe that would like infringe on splittery do licensing. I'm not sure. Not really sure. But let's go. Uh, okay, there we go with this. Good, good. And I think here is where we can get some kind of parking. Um, let's go angly. Sure. Let's see if this park... Oh, wow, that's... What happened to that radar? It didn't place? No. Surely I, I placed this. I remember placing that. It's trying to, it's trying to do things. No. <sighs> Okay, um, this is perfect parking, I think. Uh, all right, yep. We're going to use this one. Copy this. Can't do it, apparently, while you're doing that. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, this is even more perfect than I thought. Oh, that's nice. That's really nice. Okay, so let's just um, do this. Take that off. Delete this whole business because we now have edited this entire thing. Uh, let's reverse. Reverse. Believe that's going to be okay. We do something like this. And then is it the correct way around though? No, 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 no. Control Z. Control V. So this thing, we need to do it like this, I guess. No. Okay. 
if it works well like this, we need to have it one, two away from there. One, two. Okay. One, two. I think this will work if we do this. Really? Oh my gosh. No way. Dude, get out of the way. Okay. Okay, replace that. Okay, and so we should have... <laughs> we should have things going in the right direction. And we might. We might. Well, that's interesting. That was very weird. I've never seen that happen before. <laughs> it was really strange. Okay. Nope. Nope. Bad. Good. Okay, there we go. Nice. Alrighty. This is good. Life is now okay-ish. Let's get this going off of there. There. Click, click, click. That one goes. And then here... Here's where we can have our entrance. There we go. Look at this. Isn't that tidy? Right before this parking lot. Oh, this is so sneaky, isn't it? It's lovely. Okay. And, yep. Signal there. Signal there. Nice, nice, nice. I'm not going to care about how long these blocks are at all. I really don't. Um, I guess we could make them shorter, but I'll leave them just in case we do have eight long trains. And then we'll have the opportunity without having to completely edit this thing. Come on, thing. Thank you, autosave. Okay, very good. All right, and we're here. We are back at our station, and we're ready to go. So, let's see. How is this going to get out? Maybe we could take it up here. That would be fine as well. Wow, this copper is very close. Very, very close. Let's take this off. Delete that. Because we know this is going to be blue circuits up here. Oh, I can't wait till this goes. Oh my god. So good. Alright. But we have to, just one thing at a time. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Let's get our 90 degree curve. I think that can go, I guess, there. Oopsies. I'm just going to like, nope, wait, why? Okay. Oh, excellent. All right, and then we'll get our signally thingy-madoos, otherwise known as signals. Those will fix all the things. Oh, no, but we need, wait, or do we have enough? We should, I guess. Yeah, Spider-Tron has everything. Like a shopping mall. It's fantastic. Okay, we'll take these. This doesn't really matter because these trains are not going to fill up very fast anyway, so it's fine. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on here, but I think I want to just redo this whole section because I saw some excess track going on there. Good, good. And close this block off with a signal. This is so exciting. Oh my god. We're almost done. We are almost done. So life is going pretty darn well here. All right. Did we rename this? I forgot. Yes, we did. Okay. So this is almost ready to go. The only thing that we did not do and might be a fatal error right now is the piping. I kind of forgot that. Um, just slightly. But it doesn't have to be a fatal error. It could go this way, I think. Yes. There's space here, I believe. All right. So let's get out of this thing. And maybe try to add piping here. Okay, that's a tiny bit too low. So let's see if we can do this in some place other than where that power pole needs to go. No. All right, we can do this. So we're going we're gonna to focus on this and then we'll add the power pole in a second. Let's see. Can we add the power pole here and still be efficacious? Yes, we can. Good. So let's copy this bit and add it there and there and delete that poor power pole. 
Yeah, this is what happens when you forget about one part of the design. It's like, no, that didn't work. Let's delete all these power poles. And then I can copy this section here. And we'll just align it with that splittery do. Apologies for forgetting to call it that earlier. That was not intentional. Um, and I guess what we can do is just... We could actually bring it straight down. Like, have one here. Let's get our... Uh, do we have pumps? I might have given them to Spidertron. Hello, Spidertron. Do you have the stuffs? <gasps> no. Oh, no. Okay. All right, Spidertron, let's go and find him. Oh, no, no, no. Too far, too far. No. Spidertron is getting distracted. It's the smell of garlic stuffs and things and food and all the bits and pieces. Okay. Um, let's have one coming in from one side and then maybe one from the other. Have one that side. Bring that pump going in this way. And we could have them up from above, I guess, as well. I just figured maybe one per side. Because there is a lot of stuff to get through coming through here, traffic wise. All right, I'm going to get out of the Spider Tron. Okay, good, good. Actually, that is not a good spot. Okay, try it again. Okay, things are not bad. Things are definitely not bad. Uh, I think we'll put this pump on this side instead. And just have a nice throughput thing right out of the, the box here. And get those under flowies going. Uh, I guess we can put some extra pumps if we wanted to. I don't think it actually matters. So I'm not going to worry about that too much. We'll just get this one going. No, I've run out of pipes. No, we might have to wait for building train to get back again. Oh no. But I'm going to put this power pole there. Oh, oh, we have, we have issues. We have issues. No. I think this is going to be too long. Yeah, too long. So this is going to have to go like this, I think. And we can have a tiny squiggle here. That's okay. Oh, really squiggly. Okay, if you want to be that squiggly, that's your own business. I am more than happy to provide you the squiggles. Okay, here and there. And hey, the building train has saved us. All right, cool. But let's get that one off. And move it to to the left and get that pump there and we are ready for business all right we're not going to start this up today but it will be the first thing in the next episode i hope you have enjoyed this i'm really looking forward to seeing if it works it may not work so um yeah we'll have to just we'll have to leave this on a cliffhanger or a cliff lover or something happened there anyway thank you so very much for joining me if you've enjoyed this video, please do leave a like and subscribe to be informed of new videos. It is very, very much appreciated and helps me out a great deal. Remember to check out my KOS and Factorio merch and make your way to our Discord server to chat about the game, share ideas, and play on our community server. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.